is over. There are few bigger days on the football calendar than Champions League final day. Fans are beginning to pour into the stadium and the tension is palpable. It's Manchester United. They face Manchester City and it's live right here on... And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It is Manchester United facing Manchester City. Well, what a night, Derek. Two great teams, a perfect pitch, a magnificent stadium and millions watching around the world. What more could you ask for, apart from maybe different commentators? Manchester United will go with David De Gea between the posts. Jadon Sancho starts with Anthony out wide. And the responsibility of leading the line today goes to Marcus Rashford. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson gets the nod in goal. Kyle Walker plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Phil Foden plays with Bernardo Silva out wide. And handed the task of playing up front is Erling Haaland. And they get the ball rolling in the Champions League final. We're about to find out who will be crowned club kings of Europe. Rodri. Gundogan. It's with Laporte. Foden. Really doing a fine job of protecting the ball. How about the cross? The time just challenged magnificently. Well, not many would debate the point that Erling Haaland is a joy to watch whenever he's out there on the pitch. But what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, he's a player full of confidence at the moment. What a hat-trick it was in the last match. Every time the ball came to me, looked really threatening. His finishing was excellent. He's certainly going to be a marked man today. And they deal with the threat this time. Rodri, superbly read and executed. Anthony. United might be able to cash in. Fernandes. They could nudge in front. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. Bernardo Silva. Walker now. Sancho. And return to Rashford. Nicely timed tackle. Erling Haaland. De Bruyne now. Gundogan on to Haaland 
Opportunity. Oh, there's the goal that gives City the lead in the final. Will it prove to be decisive? Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. One nil then. Rafael Varan. Scott McTominay. Bruno Fernandes. And a fine tackle. Plenty of support here. Rashford. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. This could square the game. And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. And the referee doesn't hesitate. That is a spot kick. And to add insult to injury, it's a booking, Stuart. Well, I agree with the penalty. I'm not quite so sure about the yellow card, though. And this for 1-1. One, one. A goal! Accurate from the spot! Well, here it is again, and just watch the keeper. He stands still, hoping it's hit down the middle. Unfortunately for him, he's got it wrong. So back underway, they've levelled it at 1-1 one, one here. Foden. De Bruyne now. Ruben Dias. City pushing forward with options available. He's given it away. Bernardo Silva. De Bruyne. In possession to give them the lead, maybe. Oh, a goal to give them the lead. And look at the celebrations. Well, this is a very tidy finish, as you can see. He's under so much pressure, but his strength just allows him to hit through the ball cleanly. It's an excellent goal. Action underway once more. Let's see if United have the wherewithal to square the game. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. De Bruyne. And support available. And he takes it on. Determined defending. Anthony Rashford Diogo Dallo on the ball and so it is the first half story into the second half then in this battle for Champions League glory Excellent vision. Rashford. 
Fernandes. This could be the equaliser. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made from moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, as you can see, his movement is really good, which then makes the finish look easy. That's a decent goal, that's for sure. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Bernardo Silva. And Manchester City moving the ball with purpose. Walker. On to Haaland. De Bruyne. On to Silva. Must score! And the keeper did magnificently. Well, that's just a wonderful save. How did he stop that? Over it comes. And the problem not completely solved. Fernando Silva. Going well. Gunduan. Bruno Fernandes. Rashford unable to hold it. City moving the ball forwards. What can they do from here? Holland. Gundogan. Well, it might still work out for them. De Bruyne. Oh, blocked it. Here's a change for Manchester United. Keen to take it short here. Bernardo Silva. Can he give them the lead? He's foiled them on his own. Holland. Well, such a high degree of difficulty, not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. Well, it's been all City in the last 15 minutes or so and have looked great going forward. They just need to take one of the chances they've created. Oh, they could be in here, Stuart. And a goal to re-establish their advantage. Just look at the celebrations. Well, as you can see, what an excellent back heel this is to set up the goal. And then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. Well, a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. Possession one. Foden. It's with Joao Cancelo. Plenty of options. Foden. Holland. And they find a gap in the defence. That is a very fine challenge in difficult circumstances. Anthony. How can they find a late leveller? Well, it came to nothing in the end. 
Five minutes to go. Kevin De Bruyne. Walker now. De Bruyne. Silva. Very comfortable when in possession. And a crucial intervention inside the box. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Bruno Fernandes. Decent position. He's trying to create something. Oh, what a fantastic save. Well, that's a match winning save there. Not long left now. And United will switch things around personnel wise. And over it comes. And there it is! Full time! Manchester City Champions League winners! Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Manchester City. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. The champion.